I play Griffin, the Invisible Man, and uh, he's the funniest one by far. Uh, uh, there's a lot of funny characters in this movie. It's actually great because we're all sort of buddies in real life, and sometimes we'll read the lines together. We did that in the first Hotel Transylvania, which turned out a little helpful in making it a success. It wound up being a bigger success than anyone even thought of, so very excited to come back and do another one. I'm glad The Invisible Man came back. It's hard because I'm only glasses, but I try to get a lot of jokes in there. And uh, it's a little group of guys that does a bunch of jokes together, so I'm glad to still be in the mix. My character is very good looking, but you can't really tell. Um, he's got crazy red hair and uh, very pale. That's like me. I think he's a little chubby like me. And he has a fake girlfriend like me. <laughs> this one, I have a girlfriend. But there's a big debate over whether she's fake or not because she's invisible. So uh, I can't give it all away, but that's part of my story. Again, he knows what he's doing. He's very good at this stuff. He made the first one. From doing the voices, I have no idea what it's going to be like. And it's so much better than I even thought. Because I can just tell what I'm doing in here, and it's quiet. And, or you do the voices with someone else, but they're showing you sketches and a little bit of movement. But when you see the whole thing move quickly, and it looks perfect. It's unbelievable. Uh, that was, they, they found some magic there that made people really gravitate towards it. So. I'm sure they learned from the first one. There's even new technology, so they're going to just make it better and better as they go along. Well, some of the fun people that came back are, of course, Adam as uh, Dracula, and he's uh, the dad, uh, the proud dad to Selena Gomez, maybe, and she has grown up. And now she's married, and now she has a kid. And so, and then uh, Adam has a dad. There's a great grandfather involved. It's Mel Brooks, is it correct? Can we say that? So, a lot of great people involved. Andy Samberg's still around, and uh, we've got Kevin James. Some of the fun people from the first one. Everybody back, and then new additions. So, I think everyone gets their money's worth plus a little more. I'm excited to see everybody.